quick pre-ride bike check will not only help you prevent mechanical problems out in the road, but will get you home safely. Here's our six-point check. Let's take a look. Make sure the quick release in the front and back are firmly closed. When you close them, they should leave an imprint on your hand. This is especially important if you're removing the wheel for transport. Pick up the bike and spin the wheel to make sure that the wheel is centered between the brake pads. Do the same for the rear. The brakes pads should hit only the rim and not the rubber, otherwise you're going to blow out the tire when you're out on the road. When you pull back on the brake lever on the front and the back, they should be able to put two fingers between the handlebar and the brake lever when fully engaged. Failure to do so may decrease braking performance or may indicate you forgot to close the brake quick release. Feel both the front and the back tire to make sure they're adequately inflated. You can get a good idea of tire pressure just by feeling the tire every time you inflate it. Remember that butyl tires will lose approximately 1 psi per day. Finally, make sure that everything is adequately secure, whether it be your Garmin, your lights, water bottle, if you should carry a pump, and your saddlebag. That's our six-point check, but in addition, I do things something weekly, and that's I check the brakes and the headset by grabbing the brakes, pushing forward, making sure there's no motion in the headset itself. Try to move the bike side to side to see if there's any play in the hubs. Finally, weekly, I carefully inspect the front and back tire, looking for small tears, embedded substances, or defects in the tire itself. If you have any additions, please comment below. Subscribe to keep up with our latest videos. This is Tony of Tony 10 Speed. Safe cycling.